away from him. Oh, around oh, goes Todd Bodine and Nelson P.K. Jr. Nelson P.K. Jr. into the wall. Down he gets to the six of Justin Lofton. More trucks coming in. So it was Todd Bodine and Nelson P.K. Jr. that were involved in it, and then Justin Lofton gets caught up. Remember, guys, that's our point leader, Justin Lofton. The Todd Bodine's truck's in serious trouble there, and it doesn't look like Lofton's is much better. Mm. Oh, Todd just tries to dive down in the side, like we saw Hornaday do a couple times and get sideways. A lot of guys, Todd went somewhere where he, he couldn't hang onto his truck, and look at the damage off the wall, P.K. Yep. into the side of our point leader. Mm. Battle for the 10th position. What? was happening here as we see it once again. Okay, Todd jumps to the bottom. Looked like he was pretty much up beside Justin. Look at this young man, Kyle Larson. He just snakes his way through there. Wow. He said, they don't do this on a quarter mile. <laughs> this is crazy out here. At 155 miles an hour. Look at him snake through there. And also Kale Gale, yep. Dakota Armstrong, all those guys doing a great job. Tim George missing Dakota Armstrong as he veered to avoid this incident. A lot of damage to the 11 truck, the 30. Watch this decision Todd makes. He just says, I'm going inside. I'm not sure Justin really knew he was there. He did not run into him, but he wow. squeezed him all the way down to the bottom. Some, uh, some great driving by a bunch of guys to avoid this. Watch Caleb Holman go in between those trucks. I think Kyle Larson mad at it when he saw what was happening. He said, I see a hole and I'm going for it. And he made it through it. Well, I mean, uh, I just saw the replay on the on the camera. Uh, just looked like uh, 17 went and got into the six, and uh, and then they got into me. Uh, I mean, nothing I could have done apart from not being in that position, that back far in the in the field. You know, I mean, I, I was struggling with the with the truck. Uh, the beginning of the race was okay, but after that, struggled struggled after the restart, and uh, just never could uh, never could pick up the grip again. I don't know. It was loose. It was tight. Uh, a bit of everything and just frustrating because it's hard for the championship you know i'm gonna have to recover a lot but uh yeah think about next race now and you know have a new truck for the next race so